Hello everyone and welcome back to the Pokemon Diamond Randomizer Nuzlocke with your boy, Shady Sin. Welcome to episode number 9, I believe it is, off the top of my head. In the last episode we made our way to Ecritique City, I believe. We made our way to Ecritique City. Um, no, Ecritique, what am I, that's... Oh, cut, redo, redone, nah, no, just kidding, um, no, <laughs> Eterna, that's the other flight, Eterna City where we have, we have a uh, gym battle awaiting us, um, in the last episode we did have a few snags, a few snags, you know, caught a bit of a, a bit of Australia as we like to say, but hopefully we can make it through the gym today, that was not the right button. Um, I did, I did grinding for the gym, as you can see, uh, I got everyone up to level 18 except for those who were above level 18, I just left them as they were, they might be like one level higher but that's due to, I had to use them to battle as well. So I also explored um, Eterna City while I was grinding and doing my thing. So, let's get a quick team recap for you because it's already been a hot minute. Uh, Hercule, rock and same moveset as a last time. Crouch, rock smasho, and low kick and Leah. We have Cheryl holding the black glasses with Ember, Bite, How, and Schmig. Uh, that's the exit screen. We have Skull with Blown Club, Head Smat, Head Butt, Growl, Tail Whip. We have Sarah, Poison Sting, Acid, Toxic Spikes, Bubble Beam. We have Copper, Confusion, Hypnosis, Tackle, Confusion Rate, and finally, the newest member of the squad, we have Sifia with the Water Gun, a uh, Dragon Pulse, that's my music, um, Water Gun, and Twister and Wrap. Um, I decided to add, I know I got two Water Types, and I said I didn't want two Dual Typings, but Milotic is the uh, stat speak for itself. I would rather have a Milotic than a Badoo with highest stat, I think it was like 15. Um, plus it's just like, how can you pass up Water Pulse, Water Gun, Twister and, I mean, not to say Wrap's a good move. But anyway, I did explore, I just realized, but that's fine. Um, I have explored all of, um, just like, so you guys don't have to worry too much about it. I just went around and picked up any loose items i did get two tms if i remember correctly i got the tm for minimize, minimize which is normally recycle and i got the tm for whatever number two is anyway no one on my team can learn it so uh that's a bit yikes uh leaf storm that's gonna come in clutch later if i get a good um grass type that can actually use it hey buddy Hey champion, this guy's zippity zippity. Cool. I'm actually kind of hyped for this actually. I'm glad that I got those encounters. I was thinking about adding a skur skip, but again, um, another water type as well. But I started with Milotic, better, better stats uh, overall. <laughs> okay, Gardenia. She's like a. Well, I, that's that's going to be like a boy. A guy. <laughs> At my gym, no one gets a battle of the gym leader me until they've defeated all the other trainers. I wait for you in the back. Good luck, challenger. Yeah, she's straight up dipping. Dipping. Alright. If I remember the pattern, it's... Um... Here. Down the bottom to the... Oh, there's four trainers. I think it's like top left, bottom right, bottom left top right anyway I did battle all the fishermen by the way and I gotta tell you what bro I think one of the fishermen had um, a team of six because he normally has like six um, six magic carps oh my or six water types <laughs> whatever whatever way you want to cut that slice of bread um, anyway that was a very interesting battle luckily all his Pokemon were like level like 11 because he had like a goodbye that had Dragon Rage, but I was safely able to navigate my way through it thanks to the help of Sarah who can actually take a hit and just kind of just 
killed it and critical hit it in one shot. Um, I did realize that I could have gotten an encounter in Mount Coronet uh, because um, I could have just walked further on route um, 17, 117. But I might save that for later. I might save that for when I go um, down the bike path and across. I reckon that might be a bit, um, a bit more better. Um, hmm. Cloister. Uh, and plus, to be honest with you, I don't know how long it was going to take me to get a... Um, a a Rosa Raid. Because just having a Badoo kind of just chilling in the back um, would be a bit of a hassle because I would have to like... Because it would just be like based on friendship that it evolves and I didn't... And then like I was looking at its moveset for Gen 4 and it was just like... It stops learning moves at like level 16 so I was like, I um, ain't about that life, you know? Um, I miss you, Abby, you know? That did way too much. It's close to big and thick. He indeed is. He indeed is. But nonetheless, um, I am recording this on a Wednesday. At the time of recording this, I am recording this on a Wednesday, so I haven't gone back for the uh, drift blim at the moment. You can't be serious. So I'm hoping if I record an episode tomorrow, maybe. Actually, I could do it tomorrow. I'll just change my time tomorrow and I'll record one episode and I'll, I might, it actually works out perfectly because I'll have cut, so I'll be able to take the quicker route. Oh, or I could get, or I could go the bike way actually. Ooh. Actually, that kind of changes things, actually. Because I could use the bike path. At the end of two boulders. Isn't that down here? Mm -hmm. um, I did stop up. Stop up. St I did stop up on some super potions. Um, do I really want to use them? I might use one on Cynthia, but... I kind of want to save them because I'm kind of hurting for money at the moment. Um, who do I lead with in this scenario? I'm going to lead with Cheryl. Um, so yeah, um, actually I might leave the drift balloon for now because then I could, if once I get the bike, I can go down the bike path. Then I can go underneath the bike path, get an encounter on the bike path. Why did I lead it with a fire type? Um, then get an encounter in Wayward Cave. And then I could maybe slip and dippy. Or does it just make sense for me to go back? Uh, yeah, don't worry, I'll figure. I will figure something out. Who the hell's gonna hit up? Uh, I'll figure something out because then I have to realize then I have to go back through Orberg, then I have to go down Rock Smash, go through Flora Roma and get there. Or I can just cut the trees, take the quick route, jump down, jump down and get there. Oh, that's a problem. That's a big problem. That's actually a big problem. Um, this is a yikes. I'm hoping that... Oh no. Okay, so I go first. That's okay. It's okay, that was a worry. If he outsped me, I would probably be dead. Acid can't miss, so I think we're fine. Um... That's a bit of a worry. Um, so yeah, I'll figure that out whenever I do it. And I'll get there and I'll, uh, you know. Hypno, 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 Toad, Hypno. Uh, hypno Psychic. La 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 la. La 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 But yeah, I'll figure something else. Even if I take my time, um, like just only use today's episode to literally just battle the gym, but I kind of don't want the whole episode just to be us battling the gym, but you know. Um, uh, 
but if that's the case, that is the case, you know. How did that not kill? But anyway. Ah, it's fine, it's fine. I got early bird, I got early bird, I got early bird. I have early bird. That's so nice to have, actually. That's actually really, really nice. That's really cooking. Hope you people are enjoying... Ah, yes, my favourite flying type. What the heck do I do with flying stop? Flying type. Um, hope you're enjoying this series nonetheless. Um... Yes. I think by the time this episode goes up, I will be away. Like I'm taking a trip away. So, yes. <laughs> but don't worry, I have... Wow, that's actually... Oh, it's a normal type, that's why. Um, but I have re pre-recorded a lot of stuff before when I go away, because I'm going to go see my auntie who lives like four hour four hour drive away from where I live so we're gonna go see I'm gonna I'm gonna go see her and stay at her house for like four days I think four or four or so days so don't worry nothing's gonna change I'm still gonna have um I've pre-recorded some episodes for those uh those days so it will be okay but by the time you see this episode um I think I'll be back will I be back what's this going up uh, I think I would have just, yeah, probably. Anyway, no clue. No clue whatsoever. Although, Cynthia's kind of putting in the work, though. I'm glad I got a Milo to actually have something that actually can take a hit. And can, like, has a bit of, bit of, bit of gusto. Yeah, that's right. Oh, it's top. It's the, uh... And then it's down here, and then it's up the top. Um, how's my team looking? Uh, do I heal? Yeah, probably. I kind of didn't want to take any more time, but that's right. It's fine. Everything's okay. It's all good. Eterna. Eterna. Sitte. Da, da, da. Yes. Da, 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 da. Okay. I do like a bit of a... I don't know, it's like about Pokemon beats, it just gets you in the mood, you know? It's just so relaxing and peaceful. But, you know... I did, uh... Talk to your boy in the... Like, you go down into that... Like, where the, um... Um where the to go down to the bike path there's a guy a scientist in there he gives you the experience share so i already talked to him and got the experience share for my training because i was sitting there and i was like oh i'm gonna have to grind up my low tickets level three i'm gonna have to switch train and then i was like oh wait a second don't you get the experience share so i went down and just talked to him got the experience share and that made my grinding significantly easier because by the time i battled all the trainers I basically had got basically the majority of the pokemon up to level 18 and I was like shit I still have to train it. It was already my low tick was already like a level 11 12 I think I think something like that pretty close to it So I was able to like just train in the grass and get shit done, you know That's cool. That's cool. You got this though All right, so now Cheryl so she should have a team of three And does it? No, she has a tur. Her strongest is a Rose Raid. Why do I think it was a Turtwig? That's right. She has a Turtwig that's like level 18, but it's like really fast. It's like a fast boy. He like slip and slides. He's like a dipping. Um. That's right. He's like super duper fast. Uh, can I talk to you? Thank you. Um. That's right. And then, yeah, and then it's Rose Raid, level like 21, 22, 21. Um, sorry, I had to do that. Um, yes. Because then, but the fact that these trainers, this trainer has a level 19 is 
of great, great concern for me because my team. I'm a bit worried because I'm looking at my team and either a strong. I'm not a strong water type, but a strong electric type. I mean, I do have um, Cubones for that. I have a uh, good old uh, Cubones for that. But unless it's like a an electric types, um, a lantern, for example, as we all know. Um, oh, I guess a four. I guess a grass type does. Oh, actually, no, I got Cheryl for that. Oh, I'm confused. Interesting. Um, who else is there? Who else is there? Am I missing someone? Cool. Am I missing someone? There's another. Is there another typing? Think. Think, my boy. Think. Nice. Got that money, money. So I'll go back in the heal. I think I'm still good on super potions. I think I still have 10. I think 10 should, should be enough to get me through the gym. I guess I could scoop up some potions maybe, maybe like a couple potions just for that. Quick, quick heal, quick heal, eh? Yeah, so that might be a, might be a safe bet. And I'm hoping that I can then pull up to Team Galactic. Actually, does anyone in my team learn cut, actually? I probably should have checked, probably. I probably should have checked that out earlier. That's a big UX on my part. Because I'm pretty sure there's, what, three levels to Team Galactic, isn't there? Or am I just blanking? I'll get... I'll get three. Hey, I'm not hurting for money anymore. Wicked. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. I like the Eterna City thing. It's actually quite nice to listen to. It's quite pleasant, you know? You kept me waiting. I'm Eterna's Gym Leader Gardenia, the grass type master. When I first saw you, I was convinced you found your way to me. My hunch was right on the money. You have a winning aura about you. So anyway, let's have a fun battle. Yo, Corina just straight away took her line. Alright. Three Pokemon. Rich girl Tristan sends out a psychic type. Luckily, I haven't changed my team. I didn't even think about that. Wait, it's level 21? Ah, that's a big, that's a big problem. Um, that's concerning. This is very concerning for me. You see, gets endure. I guess the more you know, I guess, eh? The more you know... You gonna be like that? Hopefully, I can't use it this next turn. Okay. Oh, that's right, you have potions. I forgot. Train other trainers do have potions. I completely forgot about that. But I guess um, I'm the only trainer that matters, apparently. So they say. So they say, and you have rest. Okay, all right. Why is my okay? I might have to sub the ba ba. Ah, so we're playing the uh, the really, really the real long game here. If you rest again, I will shank you into the next dimension. Ideally, I want another turn. Give me another turn. It can't be that hard, All right? Yeah, another turn. Yes, and that's one down. Hey, that's plenty good. 
Nice, that's Boko XP, bro. Actually, wait a second, what level is... Oh, probably will. Um... How the heck do I hit a Poliwhirl? If you had better attacking stats, I could use you. Uh, I guess I'll go. I need to check out what level Houndow, Houndow revolves. I thought it was like 22 or 24. Let's have a look. Excuse me. Let us look for Houndow. That's not how you spell it. That's not probably correct. Houndow. Houndow. Damn it, it's 24. Damn it. Anyway, disregard everything. <laughs> it's 24 evolves, damn it. That's right, I should have Hound Dow soon. Ooh, he rain dances. Ooh, not good for me. Not good for me. Da -da -da -da. Come on. Give me that bread, boy. If you hear me like stop talking, it's because I'm drinking some delicious water. Because my room is very hot and is like a, a sauna, but it's nor relaxing nor comfortable and nor near in water, but you know. Why is everyone running double slap? Why is everyone hitting me five times? I feel like last episode everyone was hitting me five times, and this episode everyone's hitting me five times, and then the next episode everyone's gonna be hitting me five times. Just stop with the hitting. No one wants that. We don't do that here. No one does that here. Alright, Polywell's down. And has the rain up for me, which is kind of nice, actually. Unless it's a grass type. Oh. Oh, that's the best news I've heard. Actually, wait. The rain's up. God damn it. Ah, oh, I don't care. Actually, I could have gone out to Bronzor, actually. Ooh, that might have been actually kind of... Honestly, if this had been anything else than a Weedle, this actually would have been like a, like a decent gym. How strong are you? 20! Twenty-four. Was her rose rate always that strong? Or am I just blanking? Was her rose rate always 24? Wait, it's just heal. Oh, I got a berry, that's right. Does Rose Rate always have this much HP? No, because then Maylene has a level 30. Maylene has level 30 Lucario. Level 28 Matchup. Then well, Crasher has a level 30. Two. Level 30, 32 Floatzel. Maybe level 34. Because then Fantina has a level 35, 36 Gengar, maybe 37. Bryson has like a 39. Um, oh, you're on like 5 HP. Then then um, Rourke's dad has like a Bastion on level 39. Then Candace has a level 40, 44 or 42 of Bomber Snow. And then Volkner has a level 49 Luxray. Is it always level 24? Is it? Or am I just blanking? Anyway, I'm grinding my team pretty active, pretty adequately, 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 adequ okay, I, I can't say. I might have said this before, but you're really tough. Wasn't it hard for you to raise your Pokemon to be so good? I guess that's a measure of how much you love your Pokemon. In recognition of that, I proudly grant you this. Yo, two badges, we got the forest badge, bro. I wonder if I can clean, I might have to use my mouse actually to do that. With the forest badge, you can use cut outside of battle. Now you have two gym battles. All the Pokemon you're seeing trade are big outside of the city. I was going to say, a gift from me. This is normally some grass move, I know, right? <laughs> Contains the move Ember. <laughs> it's one of my favorite moves. The heavier the fur, the more danger it causes. I don't think that happens cheap. So wait a second. This is grass knot normally. So you're trying to tell me I can teach Ember to someone who can learn grass knot. Interesting. I wouldn't mind seeing a Bronzon use a freaking grass type move if I'm being 100% honest with you. Like, he just whips out the old, uh, 
timber and is like, I'm gonna, okay. And now we need a bicycle, which means that we have to go into the t -t 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 tower. Into the tower. Actually, we've got a bit of time. That wasn't as quick as I thought it would be, but it was um, quick and nonetheless. Actually, now that I have the experience, I can kind of just give. I kind of just slap that on something so I can get some bonus XP, actually. Yeah, because the scientist boy gave it to me. Oh, yeah, I need cut. Shit. Okay, we can link up. I know HMs can get rid of other HMs, so I'm kind of hoping for that. Who would like to learn cut? That's a shock. Sarah can learn cut. Congratulations. Uh, I'm here to poison sting. I think I'm beyond the point now where... Um, and that'll be good because then I can just get rid of it with Surf. <laughs> Uh, that's the plan. Now we have a... Now we have a... Tentacles cutting trees down. That's a... That's something that's gonna definitely, uh... Sparkle the old uh, eyes, you know? Healing order. Vesper Queen, where are you at? Nice, I don't know what that normally is. Alright. How much am I gonna do with this? Or am I just gonna leave this episode short and just do it? Hey guys. Your gaze is at the stars. That's kind of cool, bro. Okay, cycle managers on board. Um, I'm gonna lead Cynthia and Hercule. Sounds like a pretty dominant pair. I just want to see if there's more trainers on the next floor. I'll just end the episode um, um, early and just do this in the next episode and start off with this and... Uh, I don't know. That was dumb. Up, up, up. Okay. That's a problem. Ground... type... Huh. Cynthia would definitely outspeed. And I don't know if you'll outspeed. But I'm willing to, uh... Okay, I did half. Confused it, I like this. Now, hopefully, it hits itself. Okay, good call. Karate Chop should kill it. Oh, look at these pro players, we're out here. We're out here just taking lives and breaking hearts, you know? Don't take that as a metaphor for uh, actually. Actually, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh no, yeah, roll out. That's fine, actually. That's fine, unless you've got a lot of electric type. Not an electric type, but I guess get that. And I have to switch into Cheryl. Here. That should be fine. We'll be alright. Because Don Fan isn't living a water pulse from a Symphia that is four levels above and is super effective and is a Milotic. So we avoid that um, conundrum, so to speak, but you know, I believe that I am. Oh, here cool. It was like seismic toss? Yo! What's seismic toss do again? So he uses a level. Heavier the foe. Honestly, let's just run all fighting type moves because let's all be honest here. It's all that chop's gonna be good for. <laughs> and for Rock Smash, actually, I guess. That might be a problem. Now, what I'm going to hope for is haha, I predicted you. Mbal Toy. You got that explosion Bal Toy. 
You want to explode everywhere? Do it, you coward. Explode everywhere. Explode on my entire team and devour it. Or not. Literally giving me no experience. Oh no! Hit me with confusion. Oh no! What will I do? Did you hear the striking monotone voice I've concocted? I feel like there's like two trains, and then I'm pretty sure you have to battle what, Jupiter. Is it Jupiter's in here? Yeah, hey, yay! Hey. Oh, actually, if your stats were higher, you're kind of just... He's just bulk boy. He just send him out. He's copper, boys. Beat Lazy Jimmy and Lazy Scarlet. I feel like that's why I like double battling, I just realized, because 4th gen had a lot of double battling, like places you actually had to double battle. Not just with, not just with, like, people. Oh wait, you actually... I didn't realize I did that. I think, as a kid, I think I ran past all these guys. I didn't really talk to people that much. Alright, I guess we'll just kind of go into it, I guess. Um, so, I mean... Yeah, anyway. I feel that's why I kinda like double battling a lot, because, like, fortunately, I had a lot of double battling where you had to either battle by yourself, or you had someone with you, which was really cool, which is what I like. Like, yeah, Bucky, when you go to Stark Mountain, you have obviously Cheryl in Eternal Forest. You have. Um, am I missing anything? I like how, like I said that. We do it plenty of times when I didn't mention it two times. Is there anywhere else we do it? Is there anywhere else we do it? Hmm, I'm trying to think. Um, where else do we do it? No, no, not that route, not that route, not that route. Not that route. Maybe Mount Cornet? I don't think so, actually. Actually, no. Where else? I think that's it. But I feel like you have to do a lot of double battling, like by yourself, though. Like there's here, there's, you can do a turn of by yourself if you felt like not wanting to battle with her. Um, okay, they have, a, they have a few more battle, double battle spots set up, which I think is pretty cool. Do I really want to battle all these trainers? Are they all actually all trainers, or are we actually just... Or is it just that one dude? Nope, apparently there's someone else. Because I'm pretty sure it's three levels high, and then Jupiter's at the top. But I kind of want my bike, so... <sighs> he so much as... Roll out. He has to roll out. He's 100% going to roll out, isn't he? I feel like I have to stay in. But he's going to be so much. That's a worry. Um, oh. That's a big problem. I'm going to uh, pretend like. Oh shit, I just put water on my deck. <laughs> Are you kidding me? You belly drum into. Actually, wait a minute, I need to check something. I need to check something here. You belly drum into a lick. Um, check moves. Uh, what's your. 100% uh, accurate, 90%. It doesn't make you flinch though. Do I back on the. Yeah, we're going for damage. We're going raw damage here, guys. I love the extra century in this gen. I love how it's just like. I love it. It's so. It's so out there. Okay, defense kills. Okay. Everything is fine. I love how it just goes. Doof, doof, doof. <laughs> I love it. It's so cool. It's such a cool, like. Alright. That would have been actually a problem. 
plus snacks. I know all about belly drum Snorlaxes, as from my Y playthrough, which by the time this goes up, uh, that would have already happened and gone up, and I got absolutely blown back. I didn't get blown back. I let it blow me back because I wanted to <laughs> wanted to be a hero and use <laughs> and use Fissure. <laughs> Oh, I still didn't use Fissure, that's kind of sad though. I would have loved to have landed that, that would have been actually kind of nutty. Alright, will I be able to beat... What's her face? This hopefully is not another level. Are you kidding me? Uh, uh, yeah, why not? I don't care. If that scientist heals, I'm gonna absolutely... We'll just make this episode. That's right, I'm down. Maybe. You have three Pokemon. I now feel like I should have left this for a different time. I would have loved an Electivire, to be honest. You know, the one I um, killed. Are you a dragon type in this game? You are a dragon type, I think. Are you? Are you a dragon type in this game? Are you dragon water or are you just straight up water? We'll find out. You are a dragon type. Oh. Thought there was something suspicious about you. But you know. And that should kill anyway, so we'll be fine. Miletic is kind of put in the work for me though, so I'm kind of happy about that. I'm not going to lie. Eradicate, we're gonna switch to Hercule. Alright. Uh, Karate Chop's my best bet here. Oh no, you bit me. Not speed. That's actually kind of crazy. Then again. I am a Machop. Once again, I'm a choke, I'm going to be balling. Ah, oh, part is level 20. Shellos. Now... I actually have nothing for a Shellos, so... Uh, let's hope that I can actually do something here. Shellos, I will bank on... Oh, I was about to hit Poison Stink, but that's cut now. I probably should organize Sarah's moves better. Nice. That's some Boko damage, bro. Oh, yeah, Mud Bomb. Yes, right, you're a ground type. Ah, uh, that's a big yikes. That shouldn't do much, though. Shouldn't do much at all. If I miss this, I will be on the phone to no one because it hit. That's fine. That's okay. Yay! Hopefully, Scientist Boy doesn't heal me. I'll be very. I want him to heal me. But if he doesn't heal me, you battle me. Jesus Christ! I was very confused. He should only have one Pokemon, though. Yep. What's so. I kind of like. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, Electric Titan. I kinda like this model for Pokemon kind of thing. Like, especially with 4th Gen. It was like, one trainer might have one Pokemon, but the other ones would have like two, or, or three, or even six at some point. But that's, but that's always to be expected with Pokemon kind of things, so... I mean... I kinda liked it, because you'd be like... Okay. You'd be like, ooh. I have to battle four trainers. This might be a problem. Not really, actually. So yeah, I feel like that's a good... Jesus Christ. Cubans will take no chill, bro. Alright, I need to switch that experience shit off of 
you know what, it's been 40 minutes, should I just save it for the end? I really don't care, I'm just gonna, uh, take that item, give, I will give you that. Alright, we're just gonna battle it, I don't even care. I'm... It is Jupiter, hey guys, can I just... Eh, did you want something? How silly of me to even ask. You want free, free the Pokemon? Yeah, that's gonna happen. Wait, that was her voice, I thought it was the dude because the dude jumped. Uh, that's not her voice, by the way. That's not her voice, by the way, Bob. That's not her voice, just disregard it. that voice that I just did. Um, I thought that was the dude. But anyway. A Rampardos, I'll take that, thank you very much. Um, num num. There's a level 20 of Rampardos, oh shoot. Oh. That's a problem. That is from a Rampardos, I do know that. Take a bite of this, you freaking child. That's right. You thought you had me. That would have, if that was head smash, bye bye. So she had level 20s, which makes sense, obviously, because freaking what's her face had like. I had level 24. But, you know. Yay! Taylor. How do I hit a Taylor? Right, we're going out to Sarah then. Stuff all the rules, I guess. We have a dream. Da, da, da. I love Team Galactic's theme though. Level 22 Taylor. Quick attack! That clean animation though. Pop, 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 pop. Pop, 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 pop. Half. Go all the way, son. Go all the way, son. <sighs> That's right. Whoa, okay, crit. That seems about I was kind of saw it. Took it in, was like, wait a minute, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage, but... That's fine. Alright, I'll give her an actual voice now. I wasn't sure who the hell was actually talking. Well, aren't you tough? It's okay though. Ah, official Pokemon statue investigation is finished. Mars has collected energy from the Valley Windworks. We're pretty much finished here. I'll let you on one little thing. Our boss is researching the myth of ancient Pokemon. With the power of mythical Pokemon, he'll be able to rule off Sinnoh. I said you keep out of Team Alpha, Team Galactic's affairs right now. This is your last warning. Hey, bro. I got my Clefa back. That's all thanks to you. But Team Galactic? Oh my god. They said Clefairy had come from space. Hand over their logic battle me. And like, they are still from space. Anyway, now they're gone. Thank you very much. I can't wait to thank you right now, but cruise over to my recycling shop. Okay, now that's out of the way. I would like to thank each and every one of you for watching today's video. If you enjoyed, please like, comment, and subscribe. I know today's episode is a bit, whoa, uh, long, but nonetheless, um, I'm actually everything done that I wanted to get done. Whoa, okay. For some reason. So anyway, guys, in the next episode, we'll be getting our bike and going down the bike path, as you so happenly do. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. I'm not even going to bother making you wait. <laughs> Just see you later, guys.